Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Bakana. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, today I'm going to talk about being black. I have my phone too because I've uh, assembled a bunch of notes just in case I start to ramble or if I lose my spot. So if I look at my phone, don't mind me. <laughs> what does it mean to be black? For me, it means to be proud, to love yourself, uh, to be a neighbor, to respect your elders, hardworking, um, as well. You have to love yourself unconditionally, so spend more time alone with yourself, write yourself a love story, a poem, look in the mirror more often. Even if you're walking by a store and you're feeling down and you turn and see your reflection, you better point and be like, you're beautiful, and keep going on with your day. Another thing too with being black, I feel like when you're in a certain area, like a country, like if you're in America or even in South America, I've noticed this is quite big, that if you're darker, it's kind of like already being a criminal. It's already a crime to just be dark. In South America, they have quotas in a lot of like the workplaces and universities that if you're too dark, you can't come in. Or even if you're too light, what is black? If I consider I'm black, somebody in another country might be like, oh, you're not black. So what is black? And I feel like you should not just refer black to a spe specific color. Like, put it together with a community, a group of people. Or even my friend was saying, like, in Africa, uh, it's not just about your skin color more, it's more about your tribe. And so don't limit yourself to just your skin color. Be cool within yourself, be cool with your community, support local black businesses if that's what you want to say, or colored business if you don't want to call yourself black. I can get that, it might be like a derogatory term. If you're colored, if you're brown, whatever you may be. Love yourself, respect yourself, be you. You have to be honest and just don't, don't care about what anybody else is trying to say to you, especially if it's negative, but if it's positive, take that to heart and try to work on something, especially if you know you're doing something wrong, but at the end of the day, love yourself because you are the president, you're the captain of your own body, of your own life. And being black, you just have to be confident. You have to respect yourself, like I said, probably 50,000 times already, but it's key to everything. Also, support black movements, black owned businesses. Um, if you notice there's a barber shop in your community and let's say you go to college and all your friends wanna get their hair cut, you know how guys are. You can reference them over to your friend, like help him out with his business, go volunteer in a community, go to the church, support people, go to a community center. Even go to school and volunteer, especially with younger kids who might have self issues or body image issues, um, skin color issues, just help them out. Everything, everything's great when you help others out. One item in my closet that I've been wearing a lot that is made by uh, someone who is black is this pin right here. And it's basically a natural girl. She has her cute fro and her wings are I don't want to say on fleek because that's so last year, right? But, you know, they're on point. They look nice. And it's just very supportive, like, to look down and see that they have something like this that's meant for someone with my skin color and someone with my hair texture. It's pretty cool. Her name's Tasha, and she's a designer. She knits a whole bunch of cool things. And I'll try to link her Etsy shop and her Instagram in the description below. She is like an amazing person. I only met her once, but she is more from the Western New York area. She supports girls with natural hair, ladies, older females with natural hair, and she's just a great person to look up to. So this goes back to what I was saying about supporting people in the community and going to even uh, apprentice under somebody in the community who you kind of look up to or you aspire to be one day is just super duper cool. So if you want to check her out, purchase one of these great pins as a gift or even for yourself, I'll leave the links below. So again, what it means to be black, it means to be proud, to be beautiful, to be kind, to be generous. You have to help your neighbors, support each other, and love yourself unconditionally. Like that alone is the main part about being black loving yourself and loving your neighbors, being kind. Support movements, go and visit people, tell someone that they're beautiful.
tell them that. It's not, it's not bad to give a compliment at all. Nothing bad comes from a compliment, a good compliment. And uh, stand up for yourself, stand up for others, and respect yourself. Know who you are. That's another big thing. Know who you are and be comfortable in your skin and do it peacefully. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. I hope you kind of like found a little bit of message in any of maybe everything that I said. My name is Bukana. This is my channel. And even if you clicked on it by accident, thank you so much. Like this video if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to stay tuned. I also make a lot of fashion videos because that's just my favorite thing in the world, other than my family and food, is fashion. And so thank you very much. Bye.